Steve, I don't think there's any Easter eggs on Easter Island. We've been looking for like an hour. Relax, this place has to have them. Trust me, according to this map, we just have to bear left. Huh, a goose. Anyway, this map actually says that it's uh, five clicks that way. Huh, didn't work. Steve, why don't we just ask for directions? Who am I gonna ask? The goose? I don't know. There's got to be something around your... Wait a second. Do you hear that? I do. Is it the goose? No, it sounds like singing. And it's coming from this way. I like bread with garlic and crystal Pepsi. Wow, not bad. Any chance you guys know any songs from Encanto? Because Encanto slaps. Encanto slaps. Encanto slaps, it slaps, it slaps. Encanto slaps, it slaps, it slaps. Encanto slaps. Encanto slaps. I don't think they know any Encanto songs. They just keep taking whatever I say and turning it into songs. I just said songs three times. What? Ooh. Ask them if they have any Easter eggs. Hey, any chance you guys know where I can find some Easter eggs? Down by the bay, where the watermelons grow. Back to my home, back to my home, that's why I go. Okay, okay, I get it. You guys can sing and your harmonies are next level. But can any of you just talk? We say no, 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 no. You wanna yeah, 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 yeah. We say Okay, that's enough. I've got an idea. Maybe try asking them in a song. Good idea. Hey guys, I'm looking for some Easter eggs. Okay, that was just plain bad. Yeah. Thanks. A lot. Can any of you talk without singing? Hey, Gregory can. He's right over there. I don't do that. I don't. Very funny. You know, two can play at that game. I could be funny too. You guys should all be singing rock songs. You get it? Cause you're... Never mind. So what do you even want? Well, my friend and I came here looking for Easter eggs, but I don't see anything like that around here. Well, despite the name of where we are, this island has very little to do with Easter. What do you mean? Let me explain. The Easter Island heads are located on, well, you guessed it, Easter Island. An island west of South America in the Pacific Ocean. The native people of Easter Island, known as the Rapa Nui, call their island Rapa Nui as well, which translates to Big Rapa or Great Rapa, as it was similar to a smaller island to the west of it that was just called Rapa. But even way before that, the true name of the island was Peto Otehenua. This translates to the navel of the world, aka the belly button of the world. But it got the name Easter Island because it was discovered by a Dutch explorer on Easter. So we came all the way to Easter Island, and there's no Easter eggs. No Easter eggs. What's next? We can't park on the parkway? Actually... Are you going to tell me koala bears aren't actually bears? Well, actually they... Or that the Easter Island heads have bodies? Are you going to tell them? Or do you want me to? Ugh, I'll handle it. It's commonly thought that the Easter Island heads are just heads, but they actually have bodies beneath the soil. Many think they're just heads because for years, their lower bodies became buried in soil over time. People also thought they were just heads because the heads are significantly bigger than the bodies. 
They were made this way because it was their artistic style, and because the people who carved them viewed the head as a sacred part of their bodies. While many of them look similar, there are some slight differences in their designs and decorations. These statues were carved roughly between the years 1100 and 1650, and there are nearly 1,000 of them scattered throughout the island. The people of Easter Island only had handheld tools made of rock and it's believed that around 5 to 15 Rapa Nui people carved these statues at a time, and up to 100 plus people would help move them. They were made of soft volcanic tuff, which is made of volcanic ash and other debris, and most of the statues were made by carving them out of the Ranu Raraku quarry on the southeastern coast of Easter Island. We can even see some unfinished statues in this quarry today. In fact, there are nearly 400 unfinished statues currently there. Once finished, these statues were moved from the quarry where they were made to different locations on Easter Island. These locations were mostly stone platforms called ahus, which are found on the island's coastline and were sometimes used for burials or rituals. But some are scattered throughout the island and are believed to have been abandoned for reasons unknown. How they move them is a bit of a mystery. We know they were carved from volcanic rock horizontally and then likely either rolled to their location or even walked. They may have taken up to a year to build one, but it's believed that all of the statues were carved over a 500 year long period. They were built to honor important people from their village who passed away and were placed inwards towards villages as watchful guardians or protectors. Although they are known as the Easter Island Heads, the proper term for them is Moai, which roughly translates to statue in the Rapa Nui's native language. Well, no Easter eggs, just a thousand weird rockheads staring into my soul. Correction, a thousand moai made to honor ancestors with centuries of cultural meaning and spiritual power staring into your soul. I guess that is kind of better than plastic eggs. Hey guys, according to this map, if we go 72 clicks that way, we should- Steve, if you say click one more time, I'm gonna bury you in the dirt like Gregory. Be cool, dude. Be cool. Ah, oh, fine. I'll use the proper cardinal directions then. Tweet tweet! 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 Steve, what are you doing? What? Cardinal directions. Speaking cardinal. The bird. I'm gonna go, uh, pet that goose. <sighs> I can't believe we came all this way and couldn't find one tiny Easter egg. Well, there may not be any tiny eggs, but we did find these huge statues. Well, how big are we talking here? Bigger than you could ever imagine. These statues vary in height and weight, but the average of them is 13 feet tall and over 30,000 pounds, nearly twice the weight of an elephant. But the biggest statue stands at about 33 feet tall and weighs nearly 175,000 pounds. That's heavier than 70 rexes. But there's an even bigger unfinished statue named El Gigante, which, if finished, would stand about 70 feet tall and weigh up to 350,000 pounds. That's almost as heavy as two blue whales. Well... So much for Easter eggs on Easter Island. Well, at the very least. We got a cool history lesson and a song or two from a bunch of stone heads. I just wish we had one Easter egg. Just one. Steve, I thought I told you no more. I told you guys, 72 clicks that way. Where's he going? Isn't it obvious? To get the egg! But wait! There's so much more to learn about! Don't worry, I'll conveniently tell you about it right now. If you were to visit the statues today, they would look different from what they looked like in the past, as some are missing some accessories that they once wore, including large red hats made of stone, and even eyeballs made out of coral. Many also believe that the statues were once painted a reddish color, but that material used to paint them has since worn away. 
Another little known fact is that the backs of these statues feature carvings, likely added at a later date from when the statues were originally made. One notable figure on the statues is what is commonly called birdmen, which are human-like figures with the head of a bird. These birdmen are believed to represent the chief god of the birdman cult, Maki Maki. We did it, Roberta. We found the egg. Let, Let me get, get that, that egg, 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 egg. egg. Let, Let me get, get that, that egg, egg, egg. egg, egg. Let, Let me get, get that egg, egg, egg. Let me get that egg, egg, egg. Let me get that egg, egg, egg. Nope, nope. We came all the way to Easter Island for an Easter egg. And there is no way I'm leaving this place without one. You and your big rockhead friends can go bother somebody else. Big rockhead, huh? Why don't you say that to my face? What do you mean? I am right now. Oh, well, uh, if you don't give me that egg right now, I will... Hey, get back here! You can't run forever! Alright, maybe you can. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Did you hear the cool singing from the statues in this video? Well, of course you did, because you're here listening to me, but it doesn't matter. The point is, those were made by a friend and fan named Brendan Kent. You can find more of him over at Bren Animations on Instagram. He does art, music, animation, all sorts of stuff, so please go give him a follow. Also, I hit a super secret coupon code. You know the deal. Find it, get money off of my merch, and you can buy yourself a shirt if you need a shirt. Or a pillow, because I sell those too. Now, the awesome patrons on Patreon. My favorite 80 people besides my mom and family and all that stuff. So, special thanks to... Virginia and Harrison Way. Penny and Liam Drury. Jack and his awesome dad. Unshuman. Atticus, Marley and Lennon Kimsey, Teddy and Josie Burke, Rena May, Sophie and Remy Keffer, CL and Django Henry, Owen Pickle Simer, Erickson and Alexander L, Ronan X and Raiden Z, Connor Lecoque and Family, Jasper Source Rex, The Gowdy Bros and Mabsy, Sammy Osif, Max and Kaz, Sunshine Sparkle and the Pups, Rebecca Beanie, Toothless and Light Fury, Mika, Jordan and Maya, Ada S, Silas M, Laser Rosen, Jameson, Nolan and Lily, Julian Jackson and Jacob, Jonathan and George Chesselton Kent, Asher Evans, Connor Pendergrass, Levi and Julian Cooney, Logan Miller, JJ Schmidt, Kuchan115, Elias and his fun dad Dave from Saskatoon, Connor Higgins, Gavin and Hayden Huggin, Ocean Casey, Oliver V and Kristen, Jack Hartzler, Diego Hurado, Xavier Freeze, Max C, Alexander, Julian and David, Oshi, Lainey, Maddie and Henry, Zane and Asher Davis, Catalina Ryan from Dublin, Ireland, Luke Raposa, Aria Chaudhry, Nolan Jordan, Sultan, Judy, Nora Rita, George, George Monkey, Summers, Chase and Garrett Warner, Carter Levi and Fletcher Crawford, Evan Lee, Gavin and Ian Eshte, Jonathan Xavier from Indonesia, Paisley, Hanalei, Whitney and Brian, Stephen McPhee, Lava Liam, Carter Levi and Fletcher Crawford, Layla Delgado, Lennon and McCotnet, Jones, Page, Avalon and Cash, Gavin Meidel, Solomon Caldwell and Asa Caldwell, Bodie Turner, Connor and Emma B, Hawthorne and Willow Tree, The Puffin Boys, Bert, Kate, Ross, Lindy and Pepper, Maddie Gator, William and Joe, Roman, Mars, Odin, Tyson and Mocha, Moon and Storm from Arizona, Sam and Eddie from London, Wesley C and Jackson Bear Welch. Do you want to get your name in a video too? Please do. Please. If you do, just visit patreon.com backslash Mr. DeMeo. If you do, you can get your name in my next video. You could see my videos early. You can help me pick my next topic. Tons of stuff. Check the description box for a link. Thanks for watching, guys.